The crash of the private jet carrying Yevgeny Prigozhin, the leader of the mercenary group Wagner, and the death of everyone on board caused a huge international outcry. Many countries made remarkable statements about this incident, one after the other. The incident, which took place near the Russian capital Moscow, has become the most important topic on the world agenda. The Russian Emergencies Minister confirmed that there were seven passengers and three crew members on board and all of them lost their lives. The list announced by Rosovitsia includes Prigozhin's right-hand man Dmitry Utkin, Wagner Commander Sergei Propiskin, Evgeny Makarian, Alexander Totmin, Valery Chekolov, and Nikolai Matyusev. I don't know exactly what happened, but I'm not surprised, US President Joe Biden said after the crash. British intelligence sources said they were focusing on the possibility that Russia's internal security service FSB was behind the plane crash. Prigozhin supporters, on the other hand, have been voicing the claim that the plane was deliberately shut down in pro-Wagner media channels and have put forward various theories. However, one of the most striking claims came from in the relative Kristina Raspopova, the stewardess who died in the crash. The 39-year-old stewardess allegedly called her relatives before the flight and told them that the plane was undergoing emergency repairs and that they would fly to Moscow after the repairs were completed. According to a source close to Wagner leader, Prigozhin was confident that Putin would forgive him and was not afraid of any threats. The same source also emphasized that Prigozhin had important information about Putin. What do you think about the various theories about the downing of Prigozhin's plane? Who is known as the leader of the Wagner group? What kind of speculations can that claim? Prigozhin had important information about Putin. Lead to in terms of balance of power and domestic political dynamics in Russia.